Light is what we use to war in this kingdom. The more light you have, the more progress you make with any activity. Please listen now. Don't pray in tongues. Please listen. Because the entrance of God's word brings what? Light. If you don't hear, even faith comes by what? Hearing. And you need it to worship at another depth. The Bible says the time is coming when true worshipers will worship in spirit and truth. So it simply means the depth of your worship is powered by depth of what? Light, revelation, truth. Very quickly, one thing changed my life. And I will just drop it, help somebody here. This is 2020, many months to go. It will be beautiful if your work with God takes a new shape beginning from now. Listen very carefully. Love has many characteristics. Love has many signs, as it were. There are many things you can look at and observe and predict or say that a person loves a person. But we're not going to all of them. Like the Bible says in Romans 1, the thing that we see physically helps us to understand the eternal things, even the Godhead. It means when you look at the things in this life, you are able to understand the things in the spirit realm. Are you following? I'm trying to be as simple as possible. That's why Jesus will come and say, the kingdom of God is like, are you getting what I'm saying? And he will be using physical things like farming, physical things like building a house. Because truly, if you observe the physical things, you can understand the what? The spiritual things. Many of us here know what it means to be in a relationship, to be in love. Two things you will notice love will do to you. Number one, it will take your time. Love will do what? It will take your time. Mama, the way you are nodding your head is as if you understand what I'm saying. You have experience. I'm tempted to give you the mic, if not for time. Because something is, something is making you say that. Love will do what? Take your time. People around you must think you are foolish. Ah! Is somebody hear what I'm saying? Well wishers, friends and relatives, roommates, must look at your love for that person and say, bro, wise up. Sister, take it easy. Oh. No be so. We are students. Oh. Because you will notice you are spending more time with the person you love than anything else. And what you will notice about spending time is that time will be flying. Yes or no? The way somebody shouted yes there is as if you have experience too. The days of extra cool are now over. But some of us who are old enough to remember know how four hours meant nothing. Did you notice that you didn't have to have anything important to say before starting the call? See, listen, no, as you are laughing, pay attention. Did you notice that you did not have to rehearse what you had to say? All you had to do was hear the voice, hello, and random nonsense for the next four hours are making sense to you, a mature man. You don't care about what anybody ate. What's your business with what people are eating? But your concern now is, is what this person ate. And what the person ate after that. And what the person ate after that. Do you fulfill destiny that way? I like that. Depending on who you are loving like that. Ah, did you catch what I just said? All right. We did it all. I remember my father telling us, it was a law, do not do extra As far as I was concerned, you can't even make heaven if you are doing extra -co. How can you be wasting your life like that? Night after night, tired during morning devotion, because you are tired from call. What were you talking about? Nothing. But love will take your time. I was saying you don't rehearse before you talk to someone you are in love with. 
Love brings up discussions. And everything makes sense. Do you know the Holy Spirit wants to hear every single little detail of your life? He's not interested in hearing only the serious things like when you are stranded and you need admission, like he got to my town and my twin brother had gotten admission and we are twins, we should enter at the same time, yes or no? Because it will be very sad if they're asking you your class and they're asking him his class and we're not in the same class. That's the only reason I wanted to enter school early. Because he had got to admission. Now, I knelt down and for the first time in my life, I said, Lord, if you give me admission, I will serve you until you beg me to stop. <laughs> now, thank God for prayers like that. Where we talk to God when we need him. But it's sad when your lover only hears your voice when you are in need. Tap your neighbor and ask your neighbor, are you a Ron's gay? If it's a man, ask the man, are you a Ron's guy? That's what many believers are. They are taking God to be a sugar daddy. I don't know if you are hearing what I'm saying. Somebody you only collect things from. Is somebody hear what I'm saying? I want an army of lovers to arise from this meeting. People who will vow. Name your price. The way Jesus told you, ask and you shall be given. You will tell him, ask and it shall be given thee. Lord Jesus, ask and I will give you. You want lasso? It's too small. I will give it to you and I will wait again for another request. There's nothing you can't ask me for. That's when the blood will start counting. Yes or no? Oh, trust me, that's when the blood will start counting. So you can talk about anything to the person that you love because everything is important to him. You've been in love, so you understand what I'm saying. Everything, the nonsense you don't take from your siblings, you take from that person. This you don't hear from people. You sit down, balance, and be hearing and be concentrating. Even though maybe many things are on your mind, just make sure you what? Concentrate to. Because as you give time, you must give attention. Can you say attention? This is very, very powerful. And this is lacking in many believers today. We are giving time now, successful. This is time. 12 hours, 24 hours, all manner of meetings, people are giving time. The problem is we are not giving what? Attention. And that's why we're not breaking through in consciousness that he is here now. Some of you will understand these things I'm saying in the years to come. How old are you, sir? You, 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 you're the one I'm talking to. How old are you? Nine years old. Please listen, all right? Because I'm saving your future right now. If you hear what I'm saying, you won't waste the time many of them have wasted. Every time before God counts as you give him what? Attention. He is here now. And if he's here now, whatever I will not do, if he's here now, I won't do it. Or else I will not grow in awareness of the fact that he's where? He's here. I don't know if you got what I just said. Very powerful. It changed my life 2012. Till today, it has changed my life. I have never seen a meeting where the presence and power of God was not tangible. It's this same secret. You transfer the same essence that you are carrying. Are you hearing what I'm saying? So that same consciousness that you are hosting as a worshiper, as a minister, once you pick the mic or once you start uttering words, people come under that same influence. Is somebody getting what I'm saying? You might not understand it's happening to you. But if I describe it now, you get what I'm saying. Some of you are feeling heat as I'm speaking. Some of you are feeling cold sensation. Some of you are feeling shocks. Raise your hand if you understand what I'm saying. All right. That's the energy that is in his presence. But you don't come under it if you don't give him what? Attention. So I can actually take you out on a date. I can actually buy the food for you. And we sit down and I'm on WhatsApp. Ladies, how many of you would like that? As long as you're shy eating. Those of you who, your God is your belly. 
As long as we are eating, we are fine. Does not have to give me attention. But if you truly are in a relationship that is normal, you should be bothered that he is ready to spend and still not give you attention. Are you getting what I'm saying? So as you give time, you give what? Attention. The second thing you use in knowing that love is shocking somebody is that the person begins to let go of his or her resources. The Bible says, for God so loved the world that he gave. He gave his only. We don't have time to enter into that. But believe me, Jesus meant everything to God. And he gave it because of you. That shows you already your value. Yes or no? Just by the kind of thing I can give you. Shows you your what? Your value. No matter how you tell your neighbor, I love you, I love you. Tell your neighbor, I love you. Tell another neighbor, I love you. See, this part is very easy. Tell the next neighbor at your side, I love you so much. Now, you know the measure of that I love you is how much that neighbor can take from you. That's all. How much that neighbor can what? Take from you. How much sacrifice you can make for that neighbor. And so he says, for God so loved so loved that he gave his only there was no other option it was a huge risk because after giving it was still depending on our responding are you seeing how interesting that is and it's still depending many people here have still not responded you've told him come into my life and that's where it stopped until today, he's still knocking on your heart to gain more and more and more grounds. You are not letting him in. It was a risk. A serious risk he took. And all we're saying this evening is, from today, ensure that the kingdom of God is established because of your love for God. That response to God is what I'm after this evening. Children, bask in the love and stop there. Sons, cross from that into responsibility. He paid this much. What can I do? That's what Paul lived for all the days of his life. He was owing a debt of love. Remember? Oh, no man, nothing but Lord. Love. Love, 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 love. It will take from you. I went on a journey in my own life, pastor's background, or pastor's children background, you know, church and so on and so forth. And many things inspired our sacrifice. Giving to God, fear of going to hell, anger against Satan and his work in my life, and so on and so forth. We shared this so many times. It came to a point where it was desire for power. Once I saw that God could use me, there's no sacrifice I didn't make again. I was just charging like a charger and busting the brains of demons from place to place. Happy they were shouting my name, saying, leave me alone. Just happy that they know me. And God worked with that at that time. But 2013, I struck a chord. And that was where I found out God needed me. We gathered to pray. I heard the voice of God say, thank you. Thank you for what? I thought he was whining me, so I started thanking him. Lord, I thank you. I give you glory. I give you honor and adoration. He said, Lawrence, thank you. Ha! King of glory, but I see, Father, you know, you have realized this thing. You don't even have to think it. You don't mean it anymore. Baba ye, Jackie Joe, my lady. Baba ye, Jackie Joe, my Lord, King of glory, but I see, Father, but I see God of glory. I give you glory. I give honor. I give you adoration. He said, now, wow. Ah, ah. Okay, define glory. What is glory? You are just talking. So that day, it was as if he wanted to nicely say, Ben, my son, my son. 
No, thank you. I said, thank me for what? You are the one who created us. You are the one who made us. You gave us energy to pray. If not for you, I will not be here. And I was talking and talking. He said, no. That's when I realized I didn't have to respond. He said, nine people rejected the call. Thank you. I broke into tears and I swore that day. I said, I swear. I swear. I know it's not good to swear. But I say I what? And I'm swearing again this evening. Eh. With the last drop of blood in me, I will wipe those tears. I will make him laugh. That's the day my problem started. Though. And that problem has no solution. So don't pray for me. All right? I've checked. There's no cure. Is permanent. As I'm talking, people are getting infected. You will find out. Don't worry. Just watch. It's very viral. That blood is not going in vain this evening. We're going to sing one last song and I'm out of this place. I want you to commit yourself as we sing. Are you hearing what I'm saying? Commit yourself as we sing. And don't forget what I said. You sing like you are singing to a person. Because you are. That's the reason nobody here should matter to me. I don't know what anybody is wearing. What's my business? He's standing, listening to me. If I value him, I should not even remember when anybody walked in or walked out. Yes or no? That's how you build in presence. Is somebody hearing what I'm saying? No. I know there are people here who need to hear this. Rise up on your feet, we'll take this. Jesus, Jesus, my Lord, I want to make you smile. I want to bless your heart. Jesus, Jesus, my Lord, I want to wipe your tears. I want to make you proud. Jesus, I want to make you smile. I want to bless your heart. Jesus, 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 my love. I want to wipe your tears, Lord. I want to wipe your tears. I want to make you proud. I want to make you proud. All over this place, can you shout at the top of your voice? To bless your heart. I want to bless your heart. Jesus, 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 my love. I want to wipe your tears. I want to wipe your tears. I want to make you proud. I want to make you proud. Just the voices declare Jesus. your heart. I want to bless your heart. Jesus, Jesus, my love. I want to make you smile. I want to bless your heart. Jesus, Jesus, my love.
we are loving on gets jealous. He's a jealous lover. He's a jealous lover. He's a jealous lover. He's jealous. Come on, we must never stop realizing that nature. He is jealous. God is jealous. From Genesis to Revelation, God is jealous. So this evening, all you are telling him is, Lord, you have my attention. You have my attention. From today, I will respond to your love. As it were, I will not cheat on you again. Friendship with this world is enmity with God. Go ahead, put it in your own words. Tell him in your own words. Lord Jesus, 2020 we count. I swear it will count. This year we count. All the years of drama has ended. This year, I it will count. Oh, it will count. It will count in my family. It will count in this campus. It will count in Lagos. It will count in Nigeria. My love for you will count. I'll give you more than words, Jesus. I give you more than words. You give me more than words. You give me one more than words. Raise it up, raise it up, raise it up.